Hey, McGinn, it's Mr. Lone. Welcome back to our Read Alouds. Hope everyone is doing well, having a great week. It's hump day. Let's get over that little bump and we'll get toward the end of the week. As I was looking around the shelves today, uh, easy pick for today's Read Aloud. As soon as I realized we hadn't done it before, because I have to check, there's been so many of these now. Um, we're going to do a little fun adventure with the gingerbread man. And here is the gingerbread man loose at the zoo. So kind of imagine that you were rolling around Turtleback Zoo and you see the gingerbread man. <clears throat> I woke to the sound of a rumbling, roar, and hooting, and howling, and growling galore. I ran to my window to see this strange creature. Imagine my shock when I saw my own teacher. My classmates all giggled. I joined in their game. We watched all her sounds to an animal's name. It's Zippity Zoo Day. Get ready to go. Let's load up the bus and find out what you know. We'll go on a scavenger hunt through the zoo. Here are some animal riddles for you. I'll be a detective. I know that I can. I'll solve all these clues. I'm the gingerbread man. Have a wild day, said a man at the front as we pulled out our riddles to start on the hunt. Riddle number one. I'm spotted, I'm gentle, I'm tall as a tree. A branch full of leaves is the best snack for me. I have a new baby and she is my calf. Aha, we all shouted, the answer's a giraffe. We followed the signs as we raced down the trail till we spied her long legs and spotted her and her thin spotted tail. I jumped on the railing to get a good look and out popped her tongue like a curvy blue hook. She scooped me up high and her tongue curled around, but nobody noticed below on the ground. My classmates were busily reading Clue 2. Oh no, I cried out. She's beginning to chew. I'll wiggle and jiggle as fast as I can. I'm not a green leaf. Hey, I'm the gingerbread man. I tickled her nose and she let out a sneeze. Then I zoomed through the air to some tropical trees. A long loopy vine twisted down and around, so I whipped up my courage and swung to the ground. I glanced at my paper, then knew what to do. By solving the riddles, I'll find my class too. Riddle number two. I scurry, I screech, and I swing from my tail. I'm hanging around on the small primate trail. I love sweet bananas. I'm feisty and spunky. I know it, I shout it. It must be a... Uh... Monkey. I heard a loud rustle and turned in surprise to a small cheeky monkey with curious eyes. He picked at my buttons then tried for my hat. No way, silly rascal. I can't give you that. I'm not a banana, I said as I ran. I must find my class. I'm their gingerbread man. He stayed on my tail as I dodged through the grass, but I squeezed underneath the tall habitat glass. I followed the riddles and found the big cats, the elephants, bears, and the naked mole rats. I waved to the zebra, the rhino, the seal, who was slurping down fish for her afternoon meal. The crocodile opened his big toothy trap. He eyed me like, a, like I'd make a good ginger snap. The fox licked his chops so clever and sly, my classmates had warned, stay away from that guy. I've got to keep looking. I know that I can. I'm not giving up. I'm the gingerbread man. I read the last riddle. I've got it, I said, then spied the right sign on the trail up ahead. I raced down the path and my feet fairly flew, then out from a shrug, shrub popped a small kangaroo. She started to whimper, hop this way and that, then snuffled and shuffled and slumped as she sat. Are you lost, little Joey? I'll help you get back. I'm kind of lost too. But I'm on the right track. I'm following animal clues through the zoo, and I'm willing to bet that you know this one, too. I love eating grasses. My ears are quite long. I use my strong legs as I'm hopping along. My mom has a pouch where I play peek-a-boo. I looked at my friend. See, this clue's about you. She opened her pocket and pointed inside. I tucked myself in and said, thanks for the ride. We'll follow the arrows that say kangaroo. They'll lead to my classmates and your mama, too. Together, we'll find them. I know that we can. A small kangaroo and a gingerbread man. We hopped down the path to the grassy savanna and spied a large crowd near the outback 
cabana. I popped from her pocket pocket and jumped to the ground. She sprang to her mom with a long leaping bound. My classmates all pointed and let out a cheer. We followed the riddles and we found you all here. You're such a smart cookie. You helped save the day. Our Joey got lost and you showed her the way. I'm so very proud of my super zoo crew. Now it's time to head back to our habitat too. Here's one more riddle to solve while we go. The answer is someone I think you might know. I'm smart and I'm tough. I'm a really sweet guy. I have buttons, a hat, and a little bow tie. When problems arise, I cook up a plan. We've got it, they cried. It's our gingerbread man. So boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed that story. Nice little uh, adventure through the zoo with the gingerbread man. Some nice little riddles for you to get a chance at solving. I'm going to be back um, again with another read aloud tomorrow. You have a terrific night. See you soon.